Welcome to my class in this new semester at Kingsborough Community College. I'd like to welcome all the new students and all the returning students as well. This is a little welcome message just to get you started. Um, by the way, I I'm recording this once. I plan on using this for many years. One thing that you need to know for returning students and for new students is that we have a new learning management system called Brightspace. The company that makes Brightspace is something you know, d known as D2L, but the product itself and the website is known as Brightspace, which is where you're going to find all the information that you need to get you successfully through my course. So the first thing that we need to do is get you logged on to, Pro to Brightspace, and there are multiple ways of doing it. Right now, some of them are not working. I always take the easiest way, which is to go up to the browser and start, type cuny.edu, which is the City University website, City University of New York. And over here we have Log On, and now we have Brightspace Blackboard, which is where you want to go. Now scroll down, and here you're going to find Log On to Brightspace, which you're going to click on. And here's where it takes me. It might look a little bit different for you, but this is the Kingsborough page of Brightspace. And if you notice, this semester, the semester I'm recording this, I am teaching two, uh, two courses. I'm, I'm teaching a total of five sections. That is, two sections of criminal justice ethics and two sections of business ethics. So here is where you'll get into a page looking like this, and depending on what your course looks like, I'll explain to you where to go here. Well, the first thing, and let's just use my criminal justice ethics course as an example. So if we click on criminal justice ethics, it takes you to the home page. And let me just set it up so it, you can view this the same way it would look to you. This is the way you'd get on and you would see your home page in your course. Notice the menu is going to be standard for most courses. Content, assignments, discussion, quizzes, class progress, grades, groups, class lists, video assignment. And don't worry about any of that. The easiest way to get started is right over here in content. If I click on content, it's going to bring you in and go up to overview. And now in the overview, you're going to have everything that you need to know to get started. It's going to tell you where the course is, where it meets. Sometimes they meet online. Sometimes they meet in classrooms. The information will be up there. I have a YouTube video um, to explain to you how to just navigate briefly through the course. I have a link to the course syllabus, whatever your course syllabus is. This is all going to be in this overview message. Here's a little video that I put up to explain to you how to read my course schedule. That's a little bit different than the Brightspace course schedule. That has everything basically on one page, all the deadlines, etc. to give you an idea how the course is going to proceed. Then there's a link to the actual course schedule. That is, the video will tell you how to read it. This tells you the actual course um, schedule and then I have below that depending on your course I sometimes recommend some books they're usually not required I give you all the readings that you need in in you in Brightspace uh, but sometimes having a book is helpful and these are two particularly good ones for my ethics course that is the cartoon introduction to philosophy and horn book ethics by Charles Cardwell so I think this is good enough to get you in and get you started and once you get in the next thing I want you to do is go up here and listen to this video, which you know, will give you some more information as to how to navigate through the course. Now from here, you can just scroll back up to the top. We see the overview, bookmarks, course schedule, but the important thing is week one, course. that's where we're going to start. We're going to start at week one, click on it. And you're going to start at the top and work your way down. And I have a welcome message here telling you where to go from here. And then go through item by item. Get started. Click on it. 
you'll go through that click on that moral dilemma you go through that syllabus you'll go through that and you will work your way through the course one thing I just want you to note is and I've said this before but I just want to reiterate because it's important you will find let me see in the table of contents as time goes on you will find week one week two week three will come next I will usually have two weeks up and I'm also going to set this up so that you will have um, you will have the due date maybe the date started but the, that um, that it was put up there but also the due date for all the work in this module so you can complete it as week one module week two module and you'll find there'll be 12 week modules plus a couple of extras uh, that will be using around midterm midterm time and around final time well good luck in the course uh, if you have any suggestions I'm open to them send me an email you have a problem you should be able to find me you've got my contact information here it's in the syllabus and have a great semester an enjoyable semester and a very successful semester